and the wait was not too long for you guys. Still, the same shirt. I like this shirt actually. Bad choices make good stories. You guys hear that? Bad choices make good stories. I don't really make too many bad choices anymore. I got the angels watching, correcting me along the way. So, thank God for those and for changing my mentality about a lot of things. Um, anyways, 55 miles to pick up. I just delivered the load in Walla Walla and got another local one. It picks up in Hermingston. Delivers to somewhere in Oregon, 80 miles away from there. They're building a Dollar General. Um, I already have a video of that. A while ago I did it in the springtime and so I'm picking something up from a cross dock and then delivering it direct to the Dollar General store. Um, long story short, it's supposed to be an inside delivery but I know that, I mean I'll give them an inside delivery if they want but I think they have forklifts there. So. That's what I'm going to go pick up. That's what we're doing. I got me a coffee energy drink. I don't know. I usually I usually don't buy these kind. I'm not sure what really works, but I needed something sweet. I usually don't, you know, I, I don't need candy or things like that. But once in a while, once in a while, and I'm talking about once every couple months or something, I need a, a sugar fix, it seems like. But I usually, what the usual is, I get a big old Red Bull, the tallest one they have, and a Snickers. And I eat the Snickers and I wash it down with that Red Bull. And it usually hits the spot, gives the energy, everything. Um, but today, I grabbed a couple. I grabbed this one, I grabbed another monster pink one, and then I grabbed a, a NOS as well. That way I don't have to stop later on if things are closed or whatever. Um, the reason why is after this load, there's gonna be a different load that delivers to Klamath Falls, Oregon, direct. And I don't know exactly how many miles that is, but I'm guessing it's like another, I think it's another, it's gotta be another six, 700 miles more. So after I did get this done, I still got to drive. It delivers by 3 a.m. So that's why I got me some energy drinks. I want to, I want to get the body going now, not wait till I'm already going. Uh, I'm too tired. You know what I mean? It tastes pretty good. I wish it was a little bit colder. If I had another cup, well, I do have another cup. It's this cup, but it's not meant for any drinking out of it. It's a one. It's meant for something else. You guys, you guys get the idea of what it's meant for. So that can't put this in, in ice into that cup. No, no, no. no. Do that. It's super dry in here. It's 98 degrees. Look at outside. Not too long ago, all these hills they were green. The only thing green is, take a look what's green. That's the only thing that's green. Anything that, that's being watered. Um, so. All the orchards are, are being watered, um, the corn, the, you know, whatever the horses and the cows need to eat. A lot of these farmers, I see that they water, water their stuff. That way their, their cows and horses have something to eat besides weeds. Weeds are the only thing that keep growing. Everything else is dead. You know, look, you guys don't believe me. It's 
see they water right here, obviously. All those cows down there already drove through here, already already looked at what they were doing. So the only thing green is what's being watered. Everything else, nope. See, look at those beautiful cows. They got a little cow oasis here. And the ones that, if there are any on this side, I imagine they're all dead. Because there's nothing to eat, nothing to drink on that side, nothing. Here, at least they got, you know, little streams coming through. There's a stream right down there. There's a stream down there. By the looks of it, it used to be a big river. Now, barely a stream. So that delivery is to the Dollar General. It's a brand new store they're building. And uh, sorry, I had a phone call. I couldn't finish up my conversation. I had to talk to dispatch. Um, I've already delivered, made a delivery of something to the Dollar General before. And it's a brand new store. They wanted a lift gate delivery, inside delivery. We told them we're gonna unpack it, get it done get it done like we do every single time but my understanding is they have a forklift they have to they're unloading all kinds of materials over there so we'll see if it's needed it'll be done if not then they can unload me themselves we'll see how the situation is I've never, I've never not done a delivery, you know, even if nobody pays anything or adds anything or whatever the case may be, or, you know, I, my delivery is always done. I've never had an unhappy customer, unhappy receiver, or, or, or unhappy shipper, none of that. You know, sometimes they act unhappy, but in the end, everybody's happy.
that's it guys you saw the loading process it was quick they knew I was coming when Same I got time. here when I got here they knew I was here they were just on the phone trying to trying to figure other things out so um, but once I once they told me go meet me over there the guy was already here before me with the forklift waiting waiting to get loaded so I'm gonna send them the info send dispatch my information that I'm loaded what I'm loaded with basically you send pieces weight bill of lading number and then head on head on out to delivery so that's what we're doing That's it. Easy unload. Got a little bit of exercise done. Now I'm heading to my other pickup, which is going to be a brand new video. Um, it's still in the same day, but different load means different video. What can I do? Those are my rules. I got to abide by my own rules. So thank you guys for watching. If you haven't subscribed, please do so. Catch you on the next one.